red one chose me. So you say that the red one chose you. So why were you the red one? You know what, I think that particular season, um, how they just break it down, uh, that particular year, they, I, I, they, every year they break it down, so there's, some, there's been years where there's been a female in it. So that particular year, they were looking for my team. Uh, Got it, so being a Power Ranger, you get to travel for all this weekend. Yeah, I mean, these Comic Cons have popped up all over the world. And, uh, I mean, I'm so lucky because the season that I arrived is so popular. Yeah. Uh, and it's, it's, it's afforded me the luxury to come to go all over from Argentina to Uruguay to Brazil to Cuba to Rainy Bars. So it's been quite a experience. We talked to you before, and we were talking about Resident Evil. Tell me about what you did that. You know what? So another Power Rangers convention got me uh, to audition for the Resident Evil 6 video game. So how does that work when it's a video game? You know what? All the motion capture stuff in those video games, I mean, those video games are shot just like you know, Literally, it's shot just, just like movies. So all the motion capture stuff is handled. That job took almost two years. So, like, your movie is to like a video game. So, are you like in a big you're in the suit, you got the little white balls all over you. And now they have like these facial capture things where these cameras on your face. So every, every move and the facial capture. If you tweet your eyebrow or something, they see it? It's there on the two Got it. Now going into it, you know, being a Power Ranger, do you do your fighting skills or something you're already passionate about? You know, I made, we went through a two-week course of uh, on-screen fighting, okay. which is drastically different than real life. Well, yeah, because you have to get certain angles, you have to get certain... Everything's got to be big, right. everything's got to be pretty big. So, uh, they took us through a two-week course, and then I was already trained in Jeep Kundo. Okay. But, for purpose of the show, you know, they, they did really good job taking her, so we had to stop them with a lot of the stuff. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah, you look tough, you look like you look tough. I'm joking. Yeah, but they, they do stuff like that. And you're here at the USA. Yep. What do you like? Have you been to a live MMA fight before? You know what I have? I've been to a UFC fight. Uh, I was loose, I wrecked my data lights. Oh, okay. So I started to, to follow USC, but I've been here five, six years ago. Uh, and now I love it. I, 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 rent, I rent it a lot myself, so I'm looking forward to kind of seeing someone. Now, going into the fight, what is the most like, exciting thing for you? Do you like seeing the wrestling park? Get him in those tricky corners where they get stuck in submission? Do you like the crazy knockouts? What do you like the best? You know what? What I've learned with these fights is that the, all the submission stuff is such a chess match. It really is. It's a real big chess match. They're and in and they're out. They can get out. It's all a big thing, so um, I, I kind of look forward to seeing that because it's interesting to see how the slightest little thing right. can cause the guy's arm to almost break. And, and, and no, it, and then just like one wrong move and you're in a reverse arm or yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Well, Jason, it sounds like you have some great things going on with you, but I'll let you get into the fight. I hope you enjoy having you safe. Bad beats. Thank you.